Hello everybody, Michael here and now I'm going to install the MySQL Workbench desktop client and I'm going to use it to connect to my previously installed MariaDB database server. So let's see how that turns out for us. I'm here at the download page and I have selected MySQL Workbench among all the sort of different downloads I can have MySQL Workbench here. And uh, we can note that they recommend us downloading the MySQL installer for Windows, uh, which seems fair, but it has all the MySQL products in it. So that is a good installation program. And one feature is that we can install different versions of the MySQL workbench if needed. Uh, but we need to make a custom installation and only select the things we want to install. But I only want to install MySQL Workbench, so I'm going to go with the other downloads down here. And I have already downloaded the ex uh, installation program. So I have it up here on my desktop and I'm going to go with that one because it's only installing this particular version of uh, uh, Workbench. So it's nothing much to do in the installation program. It's always nice to know where does this stuff sort of gets installed. Uh, just make a mental note of it and then just click ahead and it should just work, work right off. So let's see here. So yes, let's launch the MySQL workbench and I can move this down so we get the workbench here on our area instead. Nice. So now we're going to connect to the MariaDB. So uh, MariaDB, I did a sort of a plain installation. I got a root user. I have a, um, I just made a simple password to it. Nothing special. So let's see if this default connection will work. So I'm just going to go ahead and start connecting it. So your connection attempt failed. Uh, okay, SSL connection arrow SSL is required, but the server doesn't support it. Okay, so it seems to be a lot of stuff. You know what? We don't really care about that because we're going to go in here and we're going to edit the connection. And we see here these, this sort of basic stuff should work. So maybe if I store my password in the vault, maybe that will work. I also going to try another one here. I'm going to say use SSL equals zero. I don't want you to use SSL for now. And I'm going to test the connection with that. And I'm going to write in my password. Yes, that seems to work. Nice. Everything seems to work there. So it's a bit curious, but I think I'm going to stick with the use SSL here to avoid this uh, sort of error message. I do think you can avoid the error message also by only uh, by by adding your password and store it in the vault here. But uh, no, I think I'm going to go with this. So use SSL and test the connection. Continue anyway. Yes. So here we go. So let's go. Uh, yes, continue anyway. And we are here. And is, as you see, seems like I'm already been here. So let's do show databases like this. And yay. Uh, we have a connection. So nice. MySQL Workbench and we are now connected to an instance of MariaDB and I think that was all all the things we want to show today. Good. So have a nice day. See you a bit later. Bye bye.